I can like guarantee with like 90% certainty, which isn't a guarantee, but you know what I mean. I can, I'm 90% sure he's in the chat right now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> not, not necessarily in the chat, but he's watching. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Just a little bit of button check. Yeah. He's got to be waiting for this uh, match to go underway for you guys. Shout outs to I'm Hip for top 10 postures in SoCal, oh. I'm pretty sure. For reals, and top, like, 10, top 10 pop offs as well. Oh, right? yeah. <laughs> He's a pop off king in SoCal. Yeah. Right? Mr. Kalkan also has, some, has his fair share of really yeah. good pop offs. Except, like, with, with I'm Hip, it's like. You it's know, like a jolly type it, of pop-up. Yeah, and he's always, you know, like, the entire IE, like, jumps onto the stage. Because yeah. it's usually on, like, a big stage, you know. He, like, he'll upset a good player or someone, you know, that's seated above him, yeah. at least. Because I'm Hip is a phenomenal player in his own right. Yeah, I'm sure you all remember uh, Mexico Saga when yeah. he beat Tyrant. Just yep. jumping all over the stage. Yep, yep. And don't mind me on my phone. I'm actually just tweeting that I'm on. 2G gaming right now because I completely gaming. forgot to do that. Rip. Tweet game on deck. Yeah. Commentating. Twi Twitter deck. Tweet deck. With. Ya boy. With. Ya boy. <laughs> Nurse. Nurse mood. Alright, so we're finally, after a little bit of a delay, going to get our first game of this set. Kakan with that shape that he does before <laughs> starting a set, man. <laughs> he does it like every game. But here we go. All Smash right. Studios Kakan versus I'm Hip. I'm Hip, uh, you know, getting off to a strong start with these Pikmin tosses, but doesn't take much. Luigi... One grab and like a single hit off afterwards is like all that same damage. Yep. Both these two just going back and forth right now, but I'm hit making the most out of it off of this ledge situation. Let's see if he can find an edge guard. Uh, just trying to find something, but a great recovery from Konkan. Finally going to make it back to the ledge. He's just rolling across the stage, just trying to make sure he does not get hit by any of these Pikmin. It jumps right into I'm hit's back air. Yeah. I'm hit recognizing that um, Konkan was just jumping a little bit too much. Yeah, see? Catching his jumps from the ledge. Trying to answer with the back air. Down smash. Oh, that's a horrible angle yeah. to be at. Oh, my God. And he just God. throws the purple Pikmin at him. I think that that's, be, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's the stock right there. That was beyond Connor's mash abilities. <laughs> yeah. And uh, <laughs> interesting side B. I'm pretty sure he did not mean to do that. And right now, Konkan is just rolling everywhere across the stage. But I'm hit making the most of it. Kakan trying to put in a little bit more damage right there with that Nair setup. He's got him at the ledge. Let's see what he does here. All right, I'm hit. Isn't that up tilt? Okay, Kakan. my goodness, <laughs> Kakan, making uh, throwing us back to the pre-patch Luigi combos. Yeah. So he's gonna go ahead and get that Cyclone get to kill off of the top. But I'm hit, trying to answer back with a grab combo of his own, getting a lot of good damage with these smash attacks. Okay, still, I'm hip with solid positioning, trying to hold down the center stage and Kong Kong and answer back with a grab up air. Oh, and another down B. Let's see what he does with it. Does not catch the tech chase, though. Just going to neutral get up. Or it might have been a get up attack. I'm actually not sure. But Kong Kong at the ledge again. He's trying to make sure he can get as much damage on I'm hit, but he's answering right back with the red Pikmin. All right, another down throw into Cyclone just for the damage this time. Finally, it's a little bit of a lead. All right, I like those down smashes, trying to get rid of Pikmin. Yeah, but two purples and a white are out. That's actually going to be a lot of big damage and potential kill right here. Yeah. It's a matter of being able to make it back, though. <laughs> oh, wow. And the Nair is going to be able to yep. take out that sock. <laughs> <laughs> yep. That was a that's all I gotta say. About an that. interesting yep. and actually somewhat anticlimactic way to. <laughs> I thought something was gonna happen with the purple Pikmin and to the Kaka totally. was gonna like die off the top or yeah. something, but yeah, it didn't mean, happen right there. <laughs> he was he was definitely playing with a lot of kill potential right there. Yeah. With the double Pikmin lineup and a white. Yeah, but uh, yeah. Nair's gonna be able to take it. <laughs> you don't ever get to see that too much <laughs> unless there's Luigi on the screen. Yeah, a Nair is gonna take the stock. <laughs> And the set goes to Concon Con with Nair. 
but not quite yet because this is only game two. Yeah, going to run back to Town and City. Let's see if I'm hit can get something started here. Double up air, I like it. But right here, I'm hip getting a lot of damage and mileage off of these down tilts. Haven't seen that kind of setup from a Olimar in a while. Yeah. Donka trying to answer back with a combo of his own, taking him to the other side of the stage. Here we go, jab, jabs into grab. Oh, barely ma managing to escape that cyclone. A little bit of good um, DI from I'm hip. All right, there's a down smash. Gonna go ahead and kill a lot of Pikmin and back throw him across the stage. All right, there's another back throw taking him off stage. And a lot of good damage right here. Let's see what he does with the edge guard. Oh, okay. Back here from center stage. I'm hip taking that first stock clean, but already a dangerously high percent. And Olimar is not a very light character, not a very heavy character. Uh, Kanka trying to be on the chase on that edge guard, not quite yeah. be able to find a kill though. He's got to be careful if he gets uh, extends himself a little bit too much. As I say it though, another <laughs> Nair gonna go ahead and take the stock. Yeah, Nair's uh, pulling out a lot of victories for Kankan tonight. Down throw, forward air, Nair, and he keeps this damage going. The train does not stop. Oh, and a 73% into 80. Gonna try to catch a recovery, not quite, but actually catches a landing into a oh down B. Oh my god, that almost had me on the edge of my seat, man. All right, that's fair. I'm here trying to answer back right now. That upper not quite going to catch up though. The red Pikmin's on him though. Gonna get, and the blue Pikmin too, getting a lot of good damage. Keeping him off stage. All right, purple Pikmin. Purple Pikmin again. Yeah. <laughs> just, just all the tip, chip damage right now. And, uh, and with that chip damage, man, he's managed to close the gap already. Only 10% separating the two. Less than that now. Kanka trying to make his way in. Does not want to get hit by a purple yeah. again. Two of them are on deck right now. Yeah, Konkan is not playing with the same confidence that um, he was in the first game when I'm Hip had two purples. And actually, that's what's going to be the deciding factor because I'm Hip going to manage to sneak that forward smash in and bring us into game three. Yeah, just kept throwing those Pikmin, yeah. making sure that Konkan was not making it back to the stage. Both of these players looking really concentrated, focused, and really close to the TV screen, actually. <laughs> they both just mashed the crap out of the controller. <laughs> <laughs> all right, running back to Town City a third time. Both of these two know that it wasn't the stage's fault. It was all guts and glory right there. And <laughs> Kong Kong trying to throw out all of these hitboxes to try to catch him at the ledge. Not quite finding it, though. Keep it with us off stage play, and that Nair has been doing so much work for Kankan yeah. right now. I mean, it's been crucial for Kankan. It's found him stocks, it's breaking him out of combos. <laughs> yeah, it is a pretty busted move <laughs> in Luigi's arsenal. The purple figment is finally going to keep him off just a little bit. I'm going to try to answer back, but another Nair oh. interrupts that combo into a down B off the top. Yeah, actually catching, I'm hip air dodging, calling it out with the Cyclone. Just high enough percent for him to die off the top. And yeah. only 40% on himself right now. This is he can he can he can put this onto Olimar with a single string. He gets one grab. And it's it's bad. But I'm hit playing around that. Keeping that knowledge in mind. Just playing as safe as he can, tossing Pikmin from across the stage, getting a cross up into the forward smash. Uh, let's see what the recovery is from Kankan. Just going to recover low. I'm here trying to find these spaced out force matches. Not quite, but there's a pivot grab. Yeah. Unfortunately, not the blue one, and I don't think it would have been that uh, throw percent either. All right. Going to catch the landing, getting another combo. Not quite going to be able to finish it off, though. The platform kind of messing up Kankan right there. Kankan trying to make his way in. There's another Nair. Just trying to get as much chip damage as possible. Okay. Down throw Cyclone for the damage. Putting him in, in a potential edge guard situation. All right. Decides to just throw him back. Knows he's not in kill percent yet, despite getting the blue Pikmin grab. 
Alright, the jabs. Not quite getting much else, though. He's killing a lot of these Pikmin, actually, but hasn't been able to make his way in. and just letting I'm Hip just cycle through Pikmin. He's got white, purple, and blue. Potential for a kill throw or a smash attack to take in. And as I say, there it is. Actually getting the smash attack with the blue, though. And now he has a pretty great lineup on hand. Two purples and a blue. 87% to make up for... Four in air for 12%. Yeah, he's take got, that. He's got a lot to get through, but he's getting a lot of good damage off of these throws. Kalka trying to answer back with that up air. Let's see if he can keep up this ledge pressure. I'm hit with the high recovery, but Kalka going to be able to clip that with the back air. Okay, just going to jab out of that situation, putting I'm hit back off stage. He's at the ledge. He's going to re grab. No, he's going to opt to recover high. Oh, and it's going to land with that Nair the first time he's done it, basically. Yeah, really smart, too. And Kon Kon really excited about that.